saw the introduction, it was a very nice maker camp. Thank you, Rikoda, and thank you, Masala. If it wasn't for you, we'd have never done any of the things we now did. Can you guys guess what software did we use to make the 3D design? Like, just guess it. Hmm. Okay, guys, no need to guess. Let's start it immediately. Okay, guys, today we're going to be doing Tinkercad. Do you believe it? Yeah? Okay, let's just do it. So we type Tink. Okay, Tinkercad. Okay, press here. Click on it. Flat is boring. I agree. Sign in, join now. We're going to be doing that, but not yet. So if we go here, from mine to design in minutes, Okay, so Tinkercad can do 3D designs. Okay, electronics. Electronics? Okay, we'll move on to that later on. Code blocks. You can design your own block. You believe it? Yeah, no, you probably do. Okay, let's watch this video. Oh, hi. Hello. You like making stuff with your hands, yes. right? Yes, yeah. Well, have you ever wondered if a computer could help you make even more? All the you time. You know about All. Tinkercad. Okay. It helps you make just about anything your imagination can dream up. Thank you. Watch this. From the very first click, you're making stuff. Rocket this. ship. A mess. Anything wow. you want. Dinosaur. Tinkercad helps you take your designs out of me and into the real world by showing you how to... 3D print them. This dinosaur just wants the car. That's all I'm saying. Laser cut. A laser cut? Dog? Build them with Legos? Legos? Or make things light up and spin. Okay. Why? Because with Tinkercad, you can. Thank you. Because keeping things flat is boring. boring. Yeah. Sign up for Tinkercad now. It's free and works on any computer with an internet connection. Really? Not to mention, it saves your designs for you on cloud. Be a cloud. change maker and join the growing community of curious doers. Okay. The 3D fun revolution. Okay. Tinkercad. From mind to design in minutes. Thank you very much. I'm going to go do that right now. Okay, guys, you guys just saw the video, and now, let's do it. So, if we go up here, we can do these things on Tinkercad, but the most important thing is signing in and joining now. So, you could either sign in with your account, or you could join now. If if you're a student, you could join your class. You could, you could create your own personal account. Probably do that, but I'm a student, so I'm going to join my class. And my code is Pung. Okay, guys, this is my account. Of course, my name, Mustafa, that's my name. And the double block, the rarest thing in the universe. <laughs> no one could make this. No man, no human, no beast. <laughs> it's just so beautiful. It's so beautiful. I love it so much. I will always like you, double block. And now let's go to the cars. So this is the car that I made with my teacher, of course. Let's go tinker this. And here is the car I made with my teacher. It's a wonderful car. It's very cool, but it's not a beast like my car, you know? Like, my car is just like, my car is a beast, and like, this is just the, a car. Okay, let's go to the beast now. So if we go back, let's just enjoy the beast. And then we go to the beast. This beast. It's even as good as the double block. It's no good, but not as good as the double block. <laughs> let's go to tinker this. It's so beautiful, it's so wonderful. It's a block of cheese. So if we go here, this is my car. It's a block of cheese sliced with a thing on top and a wing. Of course, it's so beautiful. <laughs> it's beautiful. I can't look at it. It's just a beast. It's a beast, okay? 
just a beast, okay? It's a block of cheese sliced with a balloon thing on top with a wing. There are the tires right there. And there are the axles, those two axles. The small one's for the beginning, that one's for here, and then the tires all the same thing. And here's my beast. I love it so much. It's just my beast, you know. It has the air for the balloon to go on with a wing. So it makes it a cheese car. Don't mess with it. I promise it will melt. JK. So here's everything we could possibly do. Here are the four tires. Here are the two axles, of course. The short ones for the front, the long ones for the back. And the tires are all the same exact thing. Okay, so now let's, let's go back to the car, the beautiful car. Okay, so, so you see this big thing over here, like it's a, it's a big thing, like just on the middle, kind of. So this thing is, um, it's where you put the balloon. The balloon will let all the air go through this hole and come out through this one. Wait, wait, wait. Come out through this little hole over here. That will push the car to go forward. Then it will be a, a full racing car. Habariba. Okay guys, so this car fully works on air, balloon. That's the best part about it. Maybe in the future, every car will work on air. Like just no more oil, no more gas. All the air and like the oxygen outside will be so, you know, just wonderful and all that. No gas, no more wills. So that's why now the kids are the professionals, not the adults. You adults out there think you're professionals now? Nah, the kids are gonna come take over. That's why we, we're going to make our own cars and go drive them. We're going to call them the Lambo XUV, whatever. Well, so I made um, some stuff. We're just going to go through them and like I'll tell you what they are. So first, the spinning top. As you guys can see the picture, the yellow one is the one that I did with my teeth and my friends over there. And the black one, I just made it by myself. I kept the yellow one as a replicate, so yeah. And we're going to have a competition. I'll try recording the competition. So, of course, if you're gonna always lost, just press the home button, then you always see everything. So, yeah, this is all we can do. It's a very small amount of everything. So, for example, just a basic shape. What characters, bruh. Look, this is all that we, that we can do so much more. We can do Astro Bots, Bunny Eggs, and all those type of stuff. So, we're gonna try doing them, but today is just a showing game. So, yeah, this is a spinning top. You know that thing, like, it's you put it on the ground, then there's a handle, you spin it, and then it starts spinning really fast? That's what I just did. Okay, still going back. Then it loads, and then there is no picture that don't mind that. I promise we can do a, we can do stuff. So, of course, go back to the home. So, this is what I've done. A whistle. You guys are probably like, how does that even look like a whistle? That looks nothing like a whistle. So, as you guys can see, we don't blow in from the head. We blow in from the arm, but I'm going to go in through the head right now because there's a brain cell over there, and we need to go through the brain. Okay, this is the only direction that I can zoom in from. So as you guys just saw, the two things that I did, maybe we can try doing other stuff like, um, you guys just saw like characters and stuff like that, like a character, like uh, what's, like an astrobot, an astrobot or like something and stuff like that. This video was not a tutorial of how to like use Tinkercad. It was just a video of showing you guys that kids can now do 3D designs. If you just think about it in your brain, then design it on a computer and then just bring it to life using a 3D printer. It's not that difficult. And you can now make all that just by using one software called Tinkercad. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, and hit that bell so you never miss out on another video. And comment down below what other software do you, do you want us to use again. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.